Here we go. All right. It is April 16th, Monday night, and I'm so excited that you guys are all on our call. And um, we've got just some fun stuff to talk about. I know many, many of us, um, almost all of us, most of us on this on this call are getting ready for our Phoenix conference next week. Who's excited? One week from tomorrow is when I fly to Phoenix and um, I am just beyond excited. So for those of you who um, maybe haven't uh, been to a conference, we have two conventions every year. One in the spring, um, which is typically in March or April, and that's usually somewhere in the Pacific time zone, West Coast. Um, so it's in Phoenix, Arizona this April, and then next April or next year, it will be, um, I think, in Sacramento. And then um, we have one in the fall in October. And so it's coming up in Tampa. So I know for me in Ohio, I love to go to Florida in October. <laughs> So um, it's, you know, definitely if you're, if you're coming to Phoenix, you're, you're definitely going to want to make plans to come to Tampa. And if you're not coming to Phoenix, you're definitely going to want to make some plans to go to Tampa. Okay. So make sure that your um, calendars are marked for that. And, you know, now that I think of it, I'm not sure that I have put those, those dates in the pinned post, but I'm going to start doing that. So um, anyway, Let's see, do we have anybody new on the call? I don't think so, not yet anyway. Um, hopefully we'll have some new people joining us because we are gonna be doing our um, new rep startup after this. And do we have any celebrations? Anybody have anything that they wanna share? Nothing? Christy, are you trying to unmute yourself? Are you trying to? No, no, you were just, okay. <laughs> Okay. Well, cool. Well, then let's go ahead and start by um, having Evie share her story. Evie, I'll go ahead and unmute you. Um, okay. You are not muted, Evie. I don't know. Does your camera work? Oh, there you go. She's on the elliptic. She's on the... Uh... Sorry, I was on the treadmill. <laughs> She's on the treadmill. And you cut your hair. I did cut my hair. <laughs> so cute. Thanks. Hi, everyone. Um, my name is Evie, and um, Carmen asked me to talk about my story a little bit. Um, so, sorry, I'm breathing heavy. I'm doing incline training. <laughs> um, so anyway, I started Juice Plus about 10 years ago, but it wasn't until recently that, um, you know, I really noticed a difference. Um, and you ask yourself, like, why was it, why did it take 10 years for me to get to this point? So um, let's see, 10 years ago, I wasn't consistent about taking the gummies. I didn't really know the potential that it had um, for my body and for Malia as well. Um, and so I, um, I didn't take it every day, didn't really give it to Malia every day. Um, and it wasn't until these past couple of years where I was consistent with myself, but I was more consistent with Malia um, previous to that. But for myself, um, I decided that I really truly wanted to bridge the gap between the fruits and vegetables that I wasn't eating and the ones that I really was. Um, and um, so I um, started, you know, taking the gummies, the four gummies, and I do take the gummies versus the capsules just because um, on my races, I like to have the gummies, um, not the capsules, obviously. Um, although I almost choked my last race on them because I shoved too many in my mouth. Um, so anyway, um, I am, I've been an athlete my whole life, um, played soccer um, in Hawaii and overseas in Italy, and um, I've always been a healthy person, but I didn't realize that um, an athlete actually has to, um, you know, eat about 13 servings of fruits and vegetables a day, and I definitely probably wasn't even getting half of that in a day. So, you know, I um, met up with Carmen. Um, and, um, and I talked about, you know, taking the, the gummies all the time. And then, you know, I wanted to, you know, add something more to my breakfast because I wasn't really having breakfast in the morning, the most important meal of the day. And she, um, you know, suggested the shakes. And, um, and so I started taking the shakes in the morning and I really um, 
really love that before my workouts, after my workouts, um, which I'll probably have one a little later after I'm done um, on the treadmill. But, you know, I wasn't eating the fruits and vegetables that I needed. And I, you know, I train really hard. I work out probably six days a week. And so I really need to fuel my body and, um, you know, have my body um, recoup for the next day when I'm going to work out again. So I really feel like uh, the shakes have really helped with that. Um, and, um, the shred has really helped to de detox my body. Um, I feel a difference. I actually um, have started training with someone different and um, he suggested a different eating style. And so I was like, cause my goals were to, you know, actually look like I work out um, and I wanted to be stronger and I wanted to be faster. Um, I'm an OCR racer, which is obstacle course racing. So my favorite run is Savage. I'll be going to Charlotte next month. Um, and I just came back from Georgia. I got first place in my age group. Um, and so I train really hard and Juice Plus has really um, just been there for me. Um, so I decided to try a new eating method with um, this new trainer that I was uh, training with. And he had me eating a lot of protein and a lot of fat and bacon. And although bacon is delicious, um, I felt like um, I wasn't at as energized and I felt like my workouts weren't as good as they could have been. And so, um, and so I, I did that for probably about three to four weeks eating that way. And then I decided, you know what, like I really feel terrible. Maybe, yeah, you can see my muscles a little bit better, but um, I didn't feel good. And that was more important than looking like I worked out. And, um, and so I decided to do this shred the last time. Um, and so I did the shred and I feel so much better and I'm eating like I want to be eating. Um, you know, it was his suggestion. It's what works for him. It may work for other people, but for me, I wanted to, you know, continue eating the fruits and vegetables and he didn't want me to eat fruit. And I'm like, I can't have watermelon. It's in season right now. What do you mean? I can't have watermelon. And so, um, I, you know, decided that I was just going to go back to the Juice Plus way, and um, I did the shred. You know, I feel better. Um, I even lost, you know, I got a little leaner, um, and I'm still continuing to train with him, just eating the way that I want to eat versus the way that he's suggesting to eat. And I really feel a difference with, you know, my energy level and working out six days a week. I totally feel um, much better. Um, and that kind of goes with, um, I have a, I have an eight year old now and, um, she likes working out with mommy. She loves, she ran her first OCR race in Georgia last month and she had so much fun and, um, you know, me eating the way that I do influences her and she chooses, a, you know, a salad at a restaurant versus getting pizza. And she would, you know, she just had her birthday party and she didn't want pizza at her birthday party. She chose Jimmy John's, you know, sub sandwiches, um, a little bit better, but you know, um, and then, um, you know, I just, sorry, I'm looking at my notes here. Um, So um, I went back, so I ran a 5K um, probably about a month ago and I did super well. And that was, you know, eating the way that I wanted to be eating. And then I just did this race and I felt like I could have done even better um, than what I did. And so, um, you know, that's how Juice Plus has really helped me in um, being uh, the best athlete that I can be um, and fueling my body and recovering, um, you know, my body after killing it for six days and running all these races and being a mom and working out hard and coaching her soccer team, Girl Scout leader. I'm just all over the place. So it gives me the energy that I need to, you know, um, to be a good mom and to be an athlete that I want to be. And I, uh, I'm not going to change again and take any other people's suggestions on the way that I should eat because this is the way that I want to eat and the way that I feel like my body um, responds the best to. So um, that's a little bit about myself and um, 
thanks for letting me share. That's why I take juice plus. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much, Evie. And um, just a couple things about your story. First of all, the trainer that you're working with, um, now Evie's educating him about inflammation and, you know, what, it, you know, nutrition and, you know, we'll see if he's really open, you know, that time will tell with that, but what an awesome opportunity for you to be able to share with someone who obviously, you know, wants to help people be, you know, better athletes and, and to share a little bit more about what we have to offer and why, you know, you feel so much better when you eat the way that you do, right? Correct. Yes. <laughs> Um, and the other thing I just want to share is that I never knew, I, um, I didn't know Evie. When she became a customer of mine, she actually was a referral from a mutual friend of ours who, um, she was a jazzercise instructor who um, was my customer. And she taught at two different centers and she taught Evie at a different center and told Evie about Juice Plus. And that was when Evie said, oh, <laughs> I used to take that. I need to figure out where to get that again. And so she hooked us up. And um, so Evie and I didn't really know each other. And so it was a, it was a why it was a couple years of really building that relationship and doing customer care and getting, you know, just kind of um, staying in touch that brought her to the point where she um, ultimately decided to join our team. So, but I will say that from the very beginning, I saw a spark in Evie that I knew that she was someone who I wanted on my team because I knew she had something special to share with the world and that she would be awesome at this. And I was right. Yay. She hooked me. <laughs> I hugged her <laughs> and then I cooked her. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I love it. Okay. Well, thank you so much Evie for sharing. Um, well, let's see, do we have anybody else who's gotten on? Um, Jess, can, do you want to introduce Andrea? Yeah, she actually just hopped on. I was so happy to see her hop on. This is her first time. Um, so she joined our mission quite a while ago, actually. And I shared with you guys a little bit about her, but she hadn't hopped on yet. So, so excited to see her on. She's going to be sharing with us um, next week, Monday. And I'm going to be sharing a little bit too, but she's going to be talking. And so <laughs> I know she's excited about that, but her and her husband actually own a gym, a boxing gym. And I got to, I got the pleasure of going there and checking it out. And um, I just absolutely love what they're doing for people. It looks so fun. They're quite a ways away from me, um, but it looks so contagiously fun. And I just didn't want to leave. I, they had a hard time getting me out of there. <laughs> but I'm really excited to hear more from her next week. So yeah. Yay, I'm there. Yay. Okay. So um, just to clarify what Jess was saying. So next week we have our join our mission event and Andrea is going to um, be part of that along with Jessica and April. So um, I just um, put a flyer up on our pinned post so you can find that there. I will update it um, with a picture of Andrea. So all three of you are on there and, but know that that's coming up so that as you're chatting with people and doing customer care, if you're, you know, if you're talking with people, just like always, you know, if you're talking with people and they, you know, are interested in, um, you know, if they say, for example, they have, um, they have a, um, great story or they're sharing with somebody, you know, our, the Join Our Mission event is an awesome one to invite them to. And you don't, you know, obviously there's no pressure, you know, it's just come check out what we're doing and, and see if maybe you could get as excited about it as we are, right? So that's going to be a great event. Um, I do want to just show a couple things to you guys. I'm going to share my screen real quick. Um, okay. So, um, Let's see. Okay, can you guys see that? Um, can you see that okay? It's not very clear. Let's see if I can. Okay, um, so we have our Shred 10 event going on today. And um, so we're doing this once, once a month, as, as you guys know, and hopefully you're getting used to. We're, we're trying to provide events that you guys can always be inviting to. So on the first the first Monday of the month, we were always doing our team call on Mondays at 8 p.m. Eastern, 5 p.m. Pacific. Um, but then after that, we're, there's typically an event to follow. So on that first Monday of the month, we're going to plug into the Campbell team call. 
The second Monday of the month is a One Simple Change Zoom presentation. The third Monday, which is today, is a Shred 10 Facebook page. So hopefully you guys have invited to that and are um, checking in on that and you know liking, commenting, and, and encouraging your, um, your guests to participate. Um, and then the fourth uh, Monday of the week, we're doing the Join Our Mission, which is next week which is the one we were just talking about, okay? But I just wanted to really briefly talk about Shred 10 because um, I know there's some, you know, there, there can be some confusion in how we present it because Juice Plus is a four month, a four month, you know, it's a four month commitment. You know, when you order Juice Plus, yes, we have a money back guarantee. Yes, you can, you know, cancel your order and get all your money back and return your unopened product. Of course, we know that, right? But they're sending you a four month supply and there's reasons behind that, right? And so we want to, when we're sharing the Shred 10 program, we also want to be sharing it as a four month is a four month program with a 10 day jump start. Okay, that's what the Shred 10 is. It's the 10 day jump start. Um, as part of that four month program. Okay, so I really like this order form. This this is, I can post it in our Team Win Facebook page so you guys can download it and print it if you like it too. But the reason why I like it because is because on our typical order forms, um, it just spells out the shakes as, you know, a box of shakes and it, it gives you the $30.75 installment price. But we know that if people are doing a shake a day, if they're drinking a shake a day, they need two boxes of shakes, right? And if they're doing the Shred 10 program and they wanna do the Shred 10 program every month, 10 days out of every month, they actually need four boxes of shakes, okay, to get them through. Or if it's a family who's gonna be sharing the, the shakes, then you're gonna to want to, to set them up with more shakes at the beginning. And so when we do, when we use this order form, what it allows us to do is put in the shake as installment orders but with multiple boxes okay so if they if when you're talking to people about the shake and this works really really well you guys if you just explain it like this if you just say to them okay how many shakes a day do you think you want to drink do you want to drink one shake a day do you want to drink one shake every other day or do you want to drink two shakes a day and then based on what they say then you know how many boxes to order okay so this pricing right here this thirty dollars and seventy five cents it says it right there is one shake every other day okay so if they're drinking um they're, they're not going to drink the shakes every day or they're not sure if they'll be able to get in the habit they can just start with one box and that's fine if they know that they want to drink a shake every day, um, then we're going to put in two boxes on installment, okay? And of course, as always, you can pick the flavors, you know, make it however they want to, you know, however they want the flavors to be. Um, they can do the big bags or the single serves, you know, whatever works for them. Um, and then if they want to do, if they're like, no, I want to shred and I know I want to do the shred every month, then, you know, then that's, that's going to be a much bigger order, of course, right? Because two shakes a day for four months, right? So two shakes a day for 10 days, that's 20 shakes. And then times four months, that's 80, that's 80 shakes um, just for, you know, 40 of those days. Does that make sense? Thumbs up, thumbs down. <laughs> Okay, if it doesn't make sense, you know, un unmute mute yourself and, and ask me a question. But anyways, I just wanted to share that with you. Then the other part of this is as you're working your fast tracks or you're working to qualify your business, then, you know, obviously you're getting more volume at the beginning, right? So, you know, if you're, if you're putting in two shakes a day, on, or I'm sorry, two boxes of shakes, so they can have one shake a day, then that's 140. PVC towards your fast track versus just 70, right? Okay, I've got, let me see, I've got a chat. Oh, Jenny says she loves it. Oh, good, okay. So I really want this to be, um, this to be helpful to you guys so that you can, um, how do I make that go away now? Um, so that, oh, here we go. Sorry, this chat box is in my way. All right, so that you, you can, you know, be effective in um, sharing this. And then also, you know, consider sharing the quad um, instead of the trio, you know, the Omegas are an awesome new part of our product line. And, you know, we're very, very used to sharing the trio. You know, that's what I think probably the majority of us take, right? We, we take all three of those blends and that's what we're used to talking about. But the Omega is actually a big part of our success um, in, you know, getting people to have a really awesome experience with Juice Plus. So don't be shy about sharing the, the, Quad, which is the Orchard Garden Vineyard Blend and the Omegas, because people are willing to get started right away on that 
that package. Um, I've seen it lots of times and you know people are gonna you know they're gonna follow your recommendations and and you can always back down if you if you start with the quad and find that you know nope we can't that's financially not doable then you just back down to the trio and if that's not financially doable then you can back down to the orchard and garden blend but we know that the more products that people are on with juice plus the better their results are going to be okay so it's not about you know trying to just get more money out of them right it's trying to um to really have um to really have a to give them the best the best result possible shannon did you want to share your omega story oh this is really cool i'm kind of can you hear me yes okay i'm kind of new to the omegas um i thought we are we just started our second bottle but i have really thick curly hair it's coarse it gets kind of frizzy and I lose a lot of hair, like a lot of hair in the shower. Like I can literally pull clumps out. It's been like that my entire life. Um, and then I just kind of, this is gross, but I kind of like roll it up so it doesn't go down the drain, throw it away in the garbage. But I'm not losing hair anymore. Like I'm literally just getting a couple strands and it's like, it's sticking. Like even the kids are like, mom, you don't have as much hair in the shower as you had before. And I would literally take the shower head and like, rinse the tub clean to get that like extra hair out and I never worried about it because I have so much hair but I well I'm growing like other hair faster too like I'm shaving my legs more and then that's okay mm -hmm. <laughs> I'll, I'll take that but I, like my hair is not falling out like it was and I don't know if that's from the extra nutrition um or what but it was it, it really a bad amount of hair that I was losing. Like it was concerning the amount of hair I was losing. So I think it's really awesome that it's not happening anymore and it's not so messy. And I would literally pull it off my clothes all day. Like, why is this hair falling out? And now it's not. So I'm really, it's, it doesn't sound like a big deal to some people, but it's a really big deal to me. So I think that's awesome. And my nails are growing so crazy. Um, that within like three days, I have to remove the nail polish because they're overgrown. So I'm, I'm really excited. Oh, I love that. <laughs> um, the thing about it is that, you know, we don't always expect to have an, another result, you know, especially after we've been on Juice Plus for a long time and we've really, um, you know, made a lot of changes along the way. We think, oh, I feel pretty good, you know. I, you know, there's, there's not a big expectation. So when we do get a result that we can actually feel and talk about and share, then, you know, it's so much the better. And, and Jess said that the same thing happened to her. Yay. Um, you guys, this is why it's so important to be a product of our product, because, you know, you have to have your own story for people to really, you know, want to invest in this whole food nutrition for themselves. Right. If you, if you say, oh, you know, well, I think you should take the quad and they say, tell me what you, you take. And you say, oh, I just take the orchard and garden. Well, they're not going to invest in the vineyard blend and the omegas if you're not taking those, right? If you don't see the value in, in putting those in your body, why would they? Um, so it is so much about being a product of the product and gathering that story and, and really just giving your, yourself an opportunity to have the best experience possible with whole food nutrition in your body. So awesome. I want to share. Oh, good. Okay. I, I forgot. Now that she shared about the omegas, I do have a positive story. After four years, I finally got my brother to purchase <laughs> something. He bought the omegas. <laughs> so <Okay>. yay. <laughs> yes. yes. So he admit he was asking me some other questions. Uh, might have been about high cholesterol. And that's when I talked to him about the trio and he said, no way, don't push your luck. I'm going to try these omegas first. Like he was like, so he's a very, and his whole thing was, it was because of how it's direct sales. That was his whole. Yeah. Yeah. He had a bad experience with it. And so he can't, you know, but, um, but I was excited. He purchased them. So say a little prayer that he has this fantastic effect. 
Right. And, you know, a lot of times when people are negative about, um, you know, about the way, you know, the quote unquote way that Juice Plus is sold, it's because they have had a bad experience. So really, you know, that's a responsibility that we have to, you know, help them to have a good experience and to show them that, you know, this is actually a really wonderful way to do business. And it gives people a lot of really wonderful opportunities to, you know, earn extra money to save money, you know, whereas maybe, People are working full-time jobs and not able to save. You know, they can start a little side hustle like Juice Plus and save some money. Maybe it allows you to stay home with your kids. There's all different reasons why people get started. Um, but, you know, we have to show them that this is, you know, we have to show them by providing good customer care and really loving on them and giving them the education and everything. Um, okay, well, I want to really just hop on over to our Facebook page so I can just show you a couple of things um, before we get off of here. So there it is. Okay. Um, so sorry, I got to move you guys around. Um, so I just wanted to show you the pin post here. Um, so, you know, every week I, I try, usually I do it on Mondays. At some point, maybe I'll get better and do it on Sundays. But at this point, I haven't been able to quite get myself to do that yet. Um, but I always am updating to see, you know, what types of events and what, what do we have coming up, okay? So, you know, I always have our, the flyer for our team win call. I always have the event schedule, okay? So this is just in case you're like, I can't remember what, <laughs> what the event is this week. You can always go to the pin post and just revisit this, okay? Um, the fifth Friday of April is going to be April 30th. That is going to be the day, um, the day after most of us are getting home from the Phoenix conference. So I really do plan to have our team call just go probably longer as people share their takeaways from that team, from that, um, from conference. Okay. But I just wanted to make sure that you guys know that this is available. All of the flyers are here as well. So you can, um, you can kind of flip through if you need a flyer, you can download it. If you need a zoom, um, ID, you can, check here. Um, so that's, this is, I try really hard to keep this updated. I am going to put Andrea's picture right here. If, if Jess, you or, and, or Andrea, sorry, I said Andrea, it's Andrea, um, will <laughs> send that to me so I can update this flyer and have all three of you guys on there. Okay. Um, Cherry Bomb Calls, you know, if you are a qualifier on our team, um, please consider joining these calls live. We are changing them up um, moving forward after conference, where we're going to have them a little bit more targeted for where you are in the marketing plan. So if you are a VF with a qualified business, you know, you'll be um, getting some targeted training for where, where you need to grow versus if you're a sales coordinator or a leader, you know, you're growing your business in different ways. So you'll be getting some different targeted training. Okay. So consider joining our calls um, this week so you can get a little bit more information on that. Next week, we will not have those calls because we will all be at conference. Um, if you guys haven't yet, um, please either A, let me know that you are not eating the fajita bar or B, Venmo me um, the $25 per person for that fajita bar that we're having in conference. Um, and then this is on Healthy Living Revolution Live. This is our flyer for the conference. Um, the summits, this is our flyer for um, the Shred 10 uh, Group that's already formed and will be starting on the 30th. So if you guys haven't been um, invited to that Facebook event yet, please let your upline leader know and they should be able to invite you. Okay. These are future shred events. If you're ever wondering, like, when are the shreds coming up? You know, what's the shred going to be in July? Uh, save this in your phone and put them in your calendar so you always know when we're shredding. Um, and then a group of us are going to Next Gen Boot Camp this summer. So if you want to join us on that, please do. There are still some tickets available and they did extend the early bird pricing for that. So um, is there anything that anybody wants to share before we hop off? Or we don't, we're not actually gonna hop off. Sorry, here, let me stop sharing. Um, we're not gonna hop off because we're gonna stay on for our new rep startup. Um, but is there anything that anybody wants to share prior to that? All right. Well, thank you guys so much for joining us. Um, next week, we'll be back here again for our team call and then the join our mission after that. And um, if you guys are staying on for the new rep calls, please do stay on. And if you are not staying on, you guys can go about your evenings and enjoy yourself. Go on that Shred 10 Facebook page and like and comment and encourage your people to participate.
Okay. Okay, bye everyone. Stop this recording.